welcome back to my channel. I know I look a little weird and that's because the rest of my makeup, like it's kind of halfway done. And that is because I am doing my BoxyCharm unboxing with you guys um, for the month of April. I'm gonna show you guys what I got and then I'm gonna go at the end of the video, I'm gonna apply the items and show you how they work. As you can see, it is still sealed. And to be quite honest, I'm a little afraid of opening this box. And I say that because today, myself and two of my co-workers received our boxes now i get my box delivered to my home they get it delivered to work so um when i got their box i was like girl sit down and open your box like now because i want to see what you're getting and as she opened her box i started getting upset i was not happy with her box and then when i heard about the other co-workers box i was like yeah, I don't like the items you got in yours either. Um, and so I was a little aggravated and I still am a little hesitant just because we usually get similar items in our boxes. So I don't even know. I'm dreading opening this box actually. So I'm just gonna do it with you guys. I just don't wanna be upset on video. I, I really don't. So here we go. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. My heart, okay, I know this is super dramatic. It's makeup. My heart is beating because the first thing I looked into like is the palette because I really did not want the element of surprise palette. I own it already. I kind of really wanted a different palette. Okay, so I'm sure you guys haven't seen this. So this is a new insert. Instead of like the little card that they used to have, this is like an insert. It's almost like a little brochure situation. You open it up, you have all the items that you're getting in your box. Um, I think it's really cute. Then you have the curls with their photos here. And then when you look at the back, you have your coupons here. That's the one thing that I find convenient. Having your coupons attached to this only because I lose my coupons very quickly because they're so small the majority of the time. So the first thing in this month's box is this Pores No More um, mask. It is a vacuum cleaner mask by Dr. Brent. I spoke to you guys about this in my uh, sneak peeks video this retails for $47 and it is, it is a one ounce bottle so this one I don't know how this is gonna work I'm gonna give it a try I just think this is so tiny for the amount $47 honestly I'm not gonna lie even with a coupon I would not pay this I I, I, re I really wouldn't um, and it comes with this little film here oh, it looks like a silicone so it's just like a white it's not clear it's like a white little dot so it it has like a very faint kind of light smell, but it doesn't have like a bad smell. Oh, I'm wrong. Once you blend it out, it's like supposed to be like a, I don't know. It smells a little chemically, almost like they try to put a hint of like a good scent in there, but it didn't work. It's all right. Like it's not something I'd be like, oh la la, it smells delicious. And it goes on kind of clear. It does have little beads in it. And then once you kind of like massage it in place, the beads kind of disappear. The beads are like white and blue or something. So we shall see how that works. The next item I got in the box is the TARDIS Pro Glow Liquid Highlighter in the color Sparkle. Those of you who watched my BoxyCharm sneak peek video know that I really don't care for this. I didn't want this. I don't want it. So I'm gonna give it to someone else. I have a whole bunch of these little highlighters. I don't need more. It's a pretty color. I just, oh. Okay. <laughs> okay, in my defense, you know, I, I, I don't even know what to say. Okay, I like the color. The color is different. I don't have anything in this color. Okay, maybe I was talking a lot of crap. A little too soon, let's see. This actually so, looks like it would go amazing with my skin tone. Okay. Because I feel like yellows may be a little too yellow and then champagne is a little too like light for me. But this one is kind of like a... Hmm. This is actually a really good color for me. Oh my god, I feel like I've been talking a lot of crap. I mean, I have been talking a lot of crap. Hello. First impressions, amazing color. Do I need another highlighter? No. Um, okay. I actually do like this color a lot. Look how pretty that color is. And it, I mean, it blended in to my makeup. It's not too yellow. It's not too champagne-y. It's like 
it, I don't know. Okay, I was talking crap. I'll, I'll take it back. I don't know if I'm gonna love it, but I really do love the color. And it does dry really kind of powdery, like it's dry, it's not tacky. So I guess that's a good thing. By the way, the highlighter does retail for $29. So if you get that in the box and you're super excited, then you just save yourself a whole bunch of money, honey. The next item in the box is this brow fiber kind of situation by the Brow Gal by Tanya Crooks. It's called the Instant Brown Hair 2 Tinted Brow Gel with Microfibers. Um, I've seen this before, so basically it looks like this, and it's a very tiny, tiny little kind of mascara wand situation, but it's, but it's for your brow, so we're going to try this um, later on in this video. And this is number two. It is for people with kind of medium brown hair, but I'm going to play around with it. This brow gel does retail for $22. I think this is kind of pricey for a brow gel. You can go get Maybelline. I'm sure it's probably the same thing, and you'll pay like $8. I mean, it's nice to get in a boxy charm, but it's really not a have to. The next product in this box is this Desi High Definition Liquid Lipstick. I've seen the colors they're releasing. There's nothing really special. Yeah, I threw the box. There's nothing really special. The bottle, like the little container is not that special. It's kind of bulky. This thing here retails for $24. The color that I got, I don't even know because it doesn't even say. So you pay $24 and you don't even know what the name is. Because there's no tag, no nothing. Nothing. So you pay $24 for a product, there's no name on the box, there's no name, no code, no nothing. So I can't tell you guys what freaking color I got because there's nothing, there's nothing, there's, there's nothing. And to be honest, this is not a unique color, it really is not. The formulas are pretty good, we've received these products before, but there's nothing super special. This color here I have, I don't know, maybe four or five, very similar if not identical. And for $24, shit, I mean, color pop. You can pay $6 and you actually get a name in your box. I'm just saying, just saying. So the one product from this box that I was extremely happy that we would be getting is a palette. The palette that I got is the You Had Me at Hello palette. I'm gonna be honest, I would have been happy with any palette but the Element of Surprise palette because I already have the one. Um, so I'm really happy I did get a palette that I don't already own. This retails for $18, which is super affordable, and it has three, six, nine, twelve. It has 12 eyeshadows and a full-size mirror. Their packaging is super sturdy. ColourPop, you get this for $18 and you get this for $24. Really? I mean, I know they're like two different rounds. This is for the lips, this is for the eyes, but really. This palette is right up my alley. It's exactly what I was expecting it to be. You have pure, cool tones here. And I really, really like it. And you get some mattes, girl. And you're getting some shimmers, yes. And look at this, okay. This is what I'm talking about. That's pure pigment. So this is what I want to do. I'm going to go ahead and bring my mirror. I'm going to bring my little tools that I'm going to need. I'm going to zoom you guys in. And I'm going to use these products on my face to show you how they blend, how they work. Are they any good? Blah, blah, blah. Because one thing is looking at it and playing with it. Another thing is applying it. So here we go. Okay, from the palette, I'm going to use this cream color right here. And I'm going to apply that all over the lid. I actually primed already. That's why it's a little brighter up there so we're gonna blend this out i'm using one of the uh mally round blending brushes one of my favorite brushes if i'm honest and okay that pigmentation looks really good i like this i'm now gonna go into this purpley color here just because i kind of love purple and this is like a purple-ish i don't know it's like a gray tone purple it's really pretty and I'm going to add that to the crease as well. So we're just like building. Ooh. Oh, yeah. I Okay, that might actually be my favorite color in this palette. Look how pretty she is. And then all over the lid, I'm going to use this one here. That color is kind of funny because it's almost like it's a little pink, a little burgundy, a little purple, but it's still a little gray. That is super weird, but it's such a pretty color. Mm-mm, girl. Okay, look at that color payoff. Where was this pigmentation last month? I'm just saying, come on now. I'm gonna go in with this brown here because I don't want to do like a wing or anything, but I do want to add some depth. So I'm gonna go in with a very thin kind of small brush, tap that in place, and I'm just gonna blend it on, making it look like I got a, like a, a dark 
liner going on, but I'm not. We're faking it here. Now we're going to go ahead and use the fibers on our brows. Don't judge me. I still have to wax them. My brows go pretty quick. I mean, they don't grow pretty quickly. It's just that I've been lazy, okay? I'm honest. I've been lazy. I don't know if this is going to work for my... Oh, it actually, you know, it looks... Okay. When you open... Oh, it has a scent. Okay. Yeah, brow brow. Okay. It has a scent. It doesn't smell amazing, but it doesn't smell like super chemically either. And you know what? I feel like even with black, like dark hair, you would be able to pull this off. This is actually pretty cool. And my hair is black. And this actually works really well with my brows. And again, this is in brown hair zero too so just because you don't have brown hair doesn't mean it's not gonna work for you because it actually apply pretty dark in me and it works really well last but not least I'm gonna go ahead and try this product on my lips I tried everything else so why not try this as well and this is what the lippy looks like I wished it had a name or a color because those of you who actually like this would be able to invest in it but I just it says nothing. Okay guys, so here for my final verdict. I'm gonna be honest, I'll start off with this. Even though I did not use this on this video, just because it does say 10 to 15 minutes, in order to see results, you know, try to two to three times a week. I'm gonna be honest, I don't like to sit here and be like, first impressions, it was great. Or first impressions, I hate it. It's literally telling you, use it several times in a week in order to see results. So. It would be unfair for me to sit here and say this is terrible or it's great. So to be fair, I'm excited to give this a try and it's great that BoxyCharm does implement and started implementing more skincare because again, as I said in my other video, if we want to have a great canvas to apply all this makeup on, we need to take care of our skin. I learned that the hard way, guys. So it's great that they added this to the box and the fact that it's really expensive because I know I would have never paid that, so... As you guys might already know, my favorite product of this month's box is this palette. And it's not just because it's ColourPop, and it's not just because it's its pigmentation, because I'm no pigmentation girl. But it's like, I love eyeshadow. Like, it is my, it's the love of my, I love, I love eyeshadow. And so the fact that I got this palette, and it's so pigmented and buttery and blends so well, so effortless. I'm super happy with it. This is my favorite and I think I love it even more because I thought I was going to get the other one. I was like, watch, with my luck, I'm going to get that element surprise and I don't want it. So the fact that I didn't get it and I got this one, I'm super happy because it is a new addition to my collection and look at this color payoff. Super effortless. That's what I'm talking about, good pigmentation. Okay guys, that is a wrap for this video. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you agree with me and feel like BoxyCharm needs to stop sending people that have already received highlighters, more highlighters, please let me know down below. Let me know exactly how you feel. Are you upset just as I am that we didn't get the MAC lipsticks? Because they were pushing that big time. They were really pushing the MAC lipsticks and not that many people got it, but they never really advertised the Adesi lipstick until later, later when the boxes were shipped. Is that kind of shady? I'm just saying, seems a little shady to me. Before I let you guys go, I wanted to let you know that the CEO of BoxyCharm did release the first sneak peek for the month of May. BoxyCharm's CEO says that we will be getting for the month of May 2018 more cover effects, more pretty vulgar, and more pure cosmetics. Now, a lot of people are like back and forth like, hey, can you please stop with the pure? We're kind of tired of pure. I'm always happy with cover effects. And to be honest, when we're talking about Pretty Vulgar, I don't really have but one product of theirs. So I'm cool with getting more of that. I just wish that he had given more detail as to what the makeup product is. We don't know that just yet, but you guys know that as soon as I find out, you guys will find out. I'm including my social media platforms right here. Make sure you go and follow me there. Let's be friends. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. The button is right here. Super convenient. Just click that button. Also, make sure that you click the bell down below. Once you do that, YouTube will alert you every single time I have a new fun video out. I've also included a few fun videos for you guys right here, so feel free to click those. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye, guys.